Dearly beloved, all scripture is God breathed and is useful for teaching, rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness. 2 Timothy 3.16 in the late 1800s, people in different places developed similar ministry resources at the same time. The first, the first was in Montreal, Canada in 1877. In 1898, another concept was launched in New York City. By 1922, some 5,000 of these programs were active in North America each summer. Thus began the early history of Vacation Bible School. The passion that fueled those VBS pioneers was a desire for young people to know the Bible. Paul had a similar passion for his young protege Timothy, writing that scripture is God-breathed and equips us for every good work. But this wasn't just a benign suggestion that it's good to read your Bible. Paul's admon ad admonition, admonition follows that the, the dire warning that there will be terrible times in the last days with false teachers who are never able to come to the knowledge of the truth. It's essential we protect ourselves with scripture for it immerses us in the knowledge of our Savior, making us wise for salvation through faith in Christ Jesus. Studying the Bible isn't just for kids, it's for adults too, and it, is, it isn't just for summer, it is for every day. Paul wrote to Timothy, From infancy you have known the Holy Scriptures, but it's never too late to begin. Whatever stage of life we're in, the wisdom of the Bible connects us to Jesus. This is God's VBS lesson to us all. What are your favorite scripture passages? How do they point to Christ? Loving God, thank you for the gift of scripture and how it helps me learn about Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray for the people listening right now that they will feel your presence, Heavenly Father, and they will feel your presence from their head to their toe. So be blessed today, for you are a child of God. Woohoo! Jesus' mighty name. Amen.